Valued customer to the gumdrop forest. Oop, in a hurry, I see. You'd like a dusting? No problem. That'll be 50,000 gold. Oh, but you have a coupon. And as the poorly written ones that doesn't limit the amount of fairy dust I have to give you for free. <laughs> Wunderbar. And poof, there you go. You're dusted with all the fairy dust I had. You have yourself an old fashioned delightful day. Oh good, you're back. The gobblers and I have been hard at work, if you can believe it. Come, show me what you've collected. My word, that's quite a haul. I've explained the situation and the need for Splendorfins to the gobblers, and they're remarkably eager to help. They've earned their treats. I'll take the majority of the food back to my lab for safekeeping and continued study. Can you deliver the rest to the hard-working gobblers? Start with our new farmer and tell him he can plant the seeds from those gumdrops. Howdy! I done tilled this here dirt the best I could, but ain't nothing grown. I even tried yelling at it. Oh, I'm gonna give up and take a nap. You have food for me? Thanks! I didn't know food could give you energy. Wish there weren't all these little rocks in it, though. <clears throat> what? They're seeds? And I plant them and then more gumdrop trees grow? Wow! Your magic is fascinating. You should go show Gob the Builder. <laughs> Hey, wizard! Like what we done with the place? We made great progress. Uh, that is until I sort of kinda ate all my tools. Sorry. Ooh, but now I can eat. Uh, what is this? Fish eggs? Gross! <laughs> Delicious. Thanks for the grub, but there's an old store where I used to go eat tools. I mean, uh, visit. But it got overrun by trolls. Go away, 
Jesus intruder. Trolls. Yeah! Why? Why you say we need? Not need. Need. No time explain homophones. Just squeeze and twist intruder like dough. Take what intruder want. Trolls go by. What trolls go by? Trolls no have no money. Hey, wait for me. Delicious-looking, I mean, sturdy and useful-looking tools. Definitely not as appetizing as fish eggs. With a full belly and a full toolbox, I'll have the exterior of this factory all spiffed up in no time. The inner workings, well, that's enough. After a furious start, I ain't heard a peep from inside. I've been auditing factory equipment, but there's just so much to do, and I keep falling asleep standing up. Is that food for me? Gimme! Mm. Oh, I feel like a new gobbler. Thanks. Oh, the equipment is run down but operable. The problem is our power source, the Fizzle Pebble Generator. She's kaput. I can bypass the broken elements, but we'll still need something to supply the kinetic energy. I was thinking... Gobblers on treadmills. Not only will that provide the energy to run the factory that's making healthy food, it gets gobblers exercising and producing more splendorphins. 
I can round up the runners if you can procure the treadmills. There should be plenty in the gym the witch uh, Rosina hangs out in. Kiddo, I've almost got the Splendorphin samples ready to go. What are you up to? On a run for treadmills? Take your pick, but why? The factory is going to be gobbler powered, with the byproduct being Splendorphins? Genius! I love it when a plan comes together. Once you've delivered those treadmills, bring everyone outside. I've got an announcement to make. That was fast. Maybe we should put you on a treadmill, huh? Just kidding. Gobblers, on your marks, get set, go! Run! Yes, yes! The generator has come back to life. The factory is alive. The gobblers are alive. Gobblerton is alive. It's alive! It's alive! <clears throat> that is, the, the factory is up and running. And just in time for Rosina's announcement, you say? <laughs> This being efficient thing is great. My fellow gobblers, I stand before you now not as a witch, but as a gobbler. And on behalf of Gobbleton, I wish to thank our wizard friend here. Here, here! Uh but the biggest thanks goes to the citizens of Gobleton for standing up, not just for what's right, but for their minimum daily activity. It's this resolve that is allowing us to shed the yoke of Nana's oppression and get back to being thinkers, makers, and foodies. We'll do nothing of the sort. In fact, you'll do nothing at all. Tis the Gobbler Code. <laughs> not to mention the will of your king. Nuts to that. What's King Gobsmack, or any king for that matter, ever done for us? Also, I'm gonna start growing peanuts, because I can. What? What? But, but, ooh. I demand you tear down this factory, then immediately resume doing nothing, or else the king is going to be quite upset. Yeah, Gastro intestinally upset. What's he gonna do? Hop and puff and burp the place down? The gobblers have spoken, Goba. We'll no longer be pawns in anyone's game. Now, run along and tell the king his exercise plan starts tomorrow. Yeah! <laughs> Remember this feeling. It's called living. Let us vow to hang on to it, to never lose it to kings or candy or cravings again. Kiddo, a word? You've done so much for me, and for my people. I can't thank you enough, but there's one ginormous favor we still need from you. Go to Caramel City and confront the Grand Nana. Make her tell you where her gummy army is, then use these Splendorphin samples to destroy it. Until we meet again, take care of your... Well, hello, sweetie. What can Nana do for you on this fine day? Me? Rotting caramel? Silly scion. Caramel is not hurting, it is working. Livened by a most righteous endeavor. The spiral is filled with frowns and substandard treats. I can fix it. 
I can ensure everybody everywhere has old-fashioned delightful days every day. Surely that is worth a few furrowed brows and wearied gnomes, whose hearts should be filled with joy anyway, knowing the great work they do. Now, that sounds like a joyless enterprise. The perfect task for you. Fight the explodey thing, wizard. Leave the spiral to me. Sweetness prevails. <laughs> And that is why you do not reverse your hoodie with your goodie. Ah, wizard! Just who I wanted to see. Come, come, let us speak. So, how did you find Gobleton? Lacking in the cavities, yeah? Hmm, interesting that. Could be because there was no cabal there. Could be because Gobleton is not overdeveloped. Or could be the cavities are random and we have yet to determine the cause. <laughs> what have we learned, though? that the people who look so happy are truly sad. Made so by a mad queen's mad plan. I cannot let that stand, can you? Of course not. That is why you are the scion, yeah? Do not let Nana discourage you. She is not Caramel. I will show you Caramel. Onward to my estate! is Caramel, and it is time we took our company back from those who corrupted it. It is time for an old-fashioned hostile takeover. I will make the curses! My friend, you are at like a 20 right now. I need you to modulate to a 5. No curses. We must be more tactical here. Right, guys? Right. First, we must hit the product department and the Sour Nana's army of Gumis. Malwa says you found the way to do that in Gobleton? Then we destroy Nana's support amongst the people by taking over advertising. We will deliver your factory farm photos to the whole world. <laughs> then we take down the dreaded counting crypt, where the power of arcane math provides the true source of Nana's strength. Then Grand Nana will be alone with no resources. She will have to step down and let this new executive board take over. Onward to business! All right, all right. I can do this. I can do this. They are just gummies. Toothless, squishy gummies. I can... Ah! Don't speak up on people when they are planning to infiltrate the production and distribution center of an army of soldier bears. Anyway, the plan is simple. We go in, we find out who runs this place, and shut them down. Along the way, we will use your Splendorphans to cancel out the anti-joy programming in any gummies we see. Make them nice and docile again. All right, yeah, we can do this. Actoon, wizard! Halt, valued customer. Pause. New information downloading. Halt, traitors to Nana's old-fashioned caramel delights. You must be processed, then exterminated.
Bar. Now that they are out of the way, use the splint orphans on these gummies. It will shut them down for a while. But when they wake up, they will be sweeter than ever. It is working. The splint orphans are sciencing away the anti joys right before our eyes. Come on, let us. Oh no, these gummies are already active. You think you can meddle with my little pretties? Um. This is my domain, my perfect puppet show, my grand guin yarl of goom. And you, you are nothing but the splatters on my stage. matter to you that we are improving them fixing them so they cannot but they must go sour it is their divine edict the world screams out that it is sad and my beauties destroy things so it can oh uh -huh. come on wizard let us just fix these gummies 
I guess if we just met the master of this place. That was the mission, uh-huh. Mission it was. I just wish we knew beforehand she is the cuckoo bonkers. Oh, no, 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 the gummies. Oh, they were perfect. Do you not understand? They were like flowers that bloom and die in short succession. And go mad and take people down with them? Yes, beautiful. But you, you corrupted them, made them sweet, made them a lie. But for that, you will face the wrath of the true puppet master, the invisible hand on the gummy strings. Now you face the jelly monster.
are fired, Jellymancer. You cannot fire me. I quit. Unless your new administration needs a marvelous manipulator of goomies. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now that she is out of the way, I can take her as a vest of the goomies. From now on, the only thing shipping out of here will be sweets. You find Samantha, and whichever invisible, inaudible, intangible familiar she has now, and take down marketing. standing right there. <laughs> ah, Wizard, you have met Piper. That is a ridiculous name for familiar. Where do you get these notions? Hmm? Anyway, Rosina sent a chirpy from Gobleton. My sisters are taking the Splendorphin she's making to purify other Gumi plants. But marketing was once my department and I am taking it back. It also houses Nana's broadcast network, the PA announcements across Caramelia. We can use that to expose the truth of the Happiness Initiative. Yes, Phoebe, I'm getting to the horrendous danger. She is so impatient. Inside is the Gingerbread Room Academy, where Nana trains their mascots and assassins.